Alright guys, it's 2022. We dropped the fucking Lambo. We dropped the fucking Lambo. That's what you guys wanted us to do. Ah! Nope. <laughs> What's going on guys? It's your boy Mr. Raptors, the CEO of the biggest rap boutique in Canada, all right? We're working on opening and being the biggest shop in the United States. All right, so this video is brought to you by Siempre Tequila. So the Art Basel 2022 came the same way it went. Very quick, and very aggressive, and very fun. Alright, so I got a call about 7 o'clock in the morning. I don't know what the hell Mr. Snow was doing that early in the morning, but he ended up calling the boy, Mr. Raptors, and you know I never say no. Snow says, listen, I know I haven't seen you in about 5 to 6 months. I got a big project. I'm gonna hang a Lamborghini upside down, and we're gonna wrap it, and we're gonna hang it, and we're gonna spray paint it. I want you to be part of it. I said, hell yeah, let's get it. When are we leaving? Alright, so the trip got booked within 24 hours. We flew to my Good morning ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Rapid Self is here, we're out in Miami, all right? So we were with the crew, Amy Shoots, Raptors Vaughn, Carl Wolf, obviously Diego Snow, right? Today's the big day, today's the day that we've been waiting for. Today we're gonna prepare the final part, which is gonna be hanging the vehicle, Lamborghini, by its tail up in the air and Diego's gonna be painting it. So the biggest challenge that Snow had was getting the car, right? It had to be a Lamborghini. Uh, it had to be a fast Lamborghini. And we, we needed somebody to approve us hanging the Lamborghini, spray painting in the Lamborghini and hanging it by a crane. So we had Billionaires Miami. Uh, he recommended Enzo Motors. The boys jumped on board, gave us a crazy tour of their facility, which incredible millions and millions worth of cars. Um, some of the cars, I don't even know what the hell they are. Um, as you guys watching this video, you'll understand what I'm talking about. Um, so when we got to the facility, uh, we met the owners and we got the guys to sign off on the Lambo being hung by a crane. It's a little challenging it's, because it's if you hang since with it's a race car, the assemblies are all different. To take this off, we have to take the diffuser off the bottom. And that's a whole longer piece yeah. underneath, so. That's yeah. even better, I like you better. We don't need that. We don't need that. No. Right? Yeah, it yeah, it's going to be here. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. See it. Um, and, and then you can access the frame and the crash bar in the back. Perfect. Um, the only thing they have to do is obviously drain all the fluids. So when you guys give me, that, assuming the agreement's all set. We're going to do, we're going to get it soon. So yeah. we're just going to sign everything, send it to you guys. Yeah. You guys sign, and then we can just, yeah. Keep long. moving, yeah, yeah. This one, if I drop, not just we're gonna buy the car, but next day, if I drop this car, which is not gonna happen, next day my R piece is going 300,000. <laughs> easy, easy. How we were gonna do it, we were just finessing. We said we knew, we had a plan, we we're gonna make it happen, but truthfully, we had no idea. Money work. So one of the biggest things that was in the contract, the fine print was, and the Enzo put in there obviously saying, if the Lambo drops, me and Snow have to buy the vehicle. So we knew we're up for a challenge. We're ready to do it. Let's make it happen. And if it goes down, it goes down in history. We good. <laughs> All right, see you soon. Later, boys. 
What's going on guys, Mr. Rap himself is here. Day four in Miami. Um, yo, are we around that? Are we around? We are, right? Taco place? Oh, bro, you don't understand. You don't have to care. Cheers. No, not taco place. Are we around where Vaughn's well, is wrapping the car? This looks very familiar, no? I uh, can check right now. Please, yeah. We just went over to M's Motorsport to check out the Lamborghini Evo that we were supposed to be wrapping. Um, so we snow and the team decided to just remove some of the decals, uh, wrap a couple of the things because we don't have a lot of time and uh, we're gonna spray paint over it. So we, Snow is working on the contract right now with his team over in, um, uh, back in Toronto with his lawyers to sign the paperwork so we can hang the Lamborghini by a crane on the 4th and so you can spray paint the car in the air um, so there's just a lot of liability <coughs> so if the car falls or drops something happens Snow is going to be responsible for purchasing the vehicle on the contract it says 200 USD we looked it up they go from anywhere from 150 to 300 so um, definitely going to be a hit I offered Snow to drop the car in the air, drop it, and let it go viral, and we we'll become millionaires the next day. So as uh, we got the sign off by Anza Motors to get the Lamborghini, we had to take the Lamborghini apart, okay? We had to empty all the fluids from the vehicle. We had to tow it to the Art Basel destination the night before. Uh, we had to make sure it's secured and we had to make sure that we have the right team to be able to hang the Lamborghini. Um, Mr. Snow thought he had it all figured out till I had Crystal Barbie, my wife, come for 24 hours. I flew her into Miami to enjoy the experience with us. My mom watched the kids, she flew in and she completely changed the whole perspective or everything was gonna go down, all right? So she literally explained to us whatever we thought we were gonna do wasn't gonna happen. I remember sitting on the chair, looking at Snow, I said, Snow, listen, man, you gotta go. You gotta go find the solution. So he went off and, and partnered out with these individuals. The price went from $3,500 to hang the car to $15,000. Um, we knew we had no choice. We had to make it happen. We have to make, we have to get an insurance in 24 hours. That's a $5 million liability. So imagine hanging a Lamborghini by a tailgate up in the air, making sure it's secured, making sure the frame stays intact, making sure it doesn't fall on the ground. And the biggest problem, the biggest challenge was how are you gonna lift the Lambo off the tow truck without scraping the front bumper? If you can do it, okay, that could be done. Okay, we can figure a solution for that. But how are you gonna put it back? Who the f is gonna lift the Lambo by their hands and put it right back in? So we had to get intelligent team to come on board and help us out and be willing to come in in 24 hours, put everything aside and make it happen. Um, so this was a very challenging situation. I didn't sleep the whole night. I was really worried about Snow's reputation. I was really worried about, uh, you know, making sure things happen. So we found a solution. We found a solution. Shout out to Enzo boys. Shout out to the boys that helped us raise the vehicle. Um, you know, we made it happen. It went off the ground. It was an incredible experience. We're flying, baby. We're flying. That moment of the vehicle being lifted. And as we watch the car get picked up by a crane slowly and you hear all these noises are happening. And better, and better, and better. Ba boom we got left it. Woo! Yes, baby! Carl Wolf had a, a performance GQ magazine, so he had literally 45 minutes to perform a show for snow as an opening. Jump on the car with one man fly down to the airport, fly out to Toronto, do a release party for GQ magazine, and a fly to Montreal for performance. Feeling 
great bro just waiting for the What's big happening? time now the truck's not working we're gonna have to pull this thing or i'm gonna spray paint the whole truck i'm telling you after the lambo truck <laughs> yeah. who, who wants to come for a ride on my lambo okay so guys hang me and let the lamborghini paint me okay yeah it's working the energy was absolutely crazy. Mr. Snow, you know, did the little countdown on top of the Lamborghini gears that we wrapped. And Pink put his piano over there and lit up the whole show. The energy was completely out of the park, man. I mean, everybody was screaming and chatting and, 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 and dancing. And that's when the opening for Snow was. He, he got into the mood, he got into the vibe, he felt the energy from the crowd, he felt the energy from Carl Wolf, and he just started creating his art piece, man. Seeing them in, in, in that in that uh, bubble of, of humbleness and the things I just keep coming to them in the positive matters uh, shows me you know I really got to work on myself as well. So definitely definitely an experience, definitely a show you did not want to miss. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed being there. Uh, thank you for watching. Hit the quick thumbs up, nail. All right, subscribe to our channel. Give, leave us a comment, let us know what you think, and let us know what you want to see in the next video. All right, we'll see you on the other side. Paparazzi, paparazzi. Paparazzi, no pictures, please. Update us, update us oh, on the please. day. Um, the show went great. I mean, we had uh, thousands of people here, a lot of liquor. We were on their 75th drink. We don't condole drinking and driving. One man, I love you. To the right, to the right, <laughs> right? Let's, let's, let's make it a movie. We made a lot of connections. Uh, we got a connection to wrap a private jet, one, of, one out of two. The gentleman's offered us to fly out to Bahamas after to his private island and party for a couple of days. So uh, we we're considering, I know David wrapped this van. Might kill me, so I might have to fly one of them home and I might fly one of my guys here. But that's for tomorrow. Today, alcohol kicked in. I'm about to end up in the strip club on somebody's lap, on somebody's left titty, and just call it a night, all right? So don't, don't, uh, <laughs> I'll see you on the other side. Arr!